Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new video. I hope you're doing fantastic, bro. Today we're watching Mr. Beast's $1 million, $5 million plane ticket. So if you're brand new, be sure you subscribe, drop a like, and let's jump right into it. Let's we're going to fly on this jet that costs half a million dollars per flight. And we're also going to fly on this $25,000 wow. private jet. Wait, is that a bed? Wait, a no, $10,000 first class seat, a blimp, and so much. What? I never seen a plane like this, man. How does niggas get in planes like with bags and but stuff? But before I show you what it's like to fly on some of the most luxurious Bro, this guy is so rich, man. Planes on the planet. Damn. We're gonna fly on the cheapest plane in the world. It's oh, really no. rickety. Here's the dollar. Dude, that looks like a man-made plane. I'm very nervous. <laughs> Nothing to be nervous about. I've done this half a dozen times. You've done this six times. <laughs> what, is it Jerry Kim? Why does this sound like a lawnmower engine? Yeah, that's, <laughs> I was gonna say that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Jeez, it's actually running the runway. Oh, Wait. He doesn't have a parachute, man. What if something bad happens? Keep your seat, my lad. Uh, you just focus on keeping me alive, Doug. I'm trying. Alright, uh, Dibs on the channel. I got what I need, you can land. Dibs on the channel, <laughs> that feels risky, man. I'm risking your life. Man. No! Doug, come on, Doug, please. That guy pays my bills, be careful. And if you guys think this is crazy, wait until later in the video when we have the most, most expensive plane ticket on the planet. Wait a minute, you're making me feel bad. Oh my god, he's coming in hot. Our wow. next plane is the $1,000 first class plane ticket. But here's the thing, boys. I bought it. all the first class seats. So sit wherever you want. Would you like some Miracle Mist lotion? Why? Wait, did this just say you bought all the seats? What? Because first class, baby. <laughs> because yeah. gone through it wrong. Why? I get nothing, man. I get nothing. I'm dying it up. Each of us Subscribe had our if you're new, boy. own seat at TV. The life. ticket also but God comes dang, with man. a decent meal, a free bag of toiletries, and pajamas. Do we get to take all this home with us? And during longer flights, recline. We should recline into a bed. I feel like I'm in a coffin, wow. which I like. Yeah, this is crazy. I never. That's, that, that, that looks like a biz, business class, bro. That should be like more than one grand. I don't and know. best of all, my favorite part about this thousand dollar plane, I don't need to speak to Nolan. I don't like this glass because it like separates me. I alone that. That is the exact reason why I like it. The only downside <laughs> is that you don't get a lot of privacy. It's really awkward filming a video with all these people walking by. So. Why you want privacy in a plane? Like, what do you want to do in there, bro? Just go to the bathroom if you want Let's privacy. see what a plane ticket that is 10 times more expensive feels like. And now, Ooh. the $10,000 plane ticket. Emirates. Oh, man, this is nice. I have unlimited legroom here. Look, let's wow. start off by analyzing what we get. A tablet, a giant touchscreen TV, my oh. own NC drink bar, snacks. This is a peaceful chocolate. I want a refund. We're getting connected to the Wi-Fi. We might have paid $10,000 for our seat, but we still have to pay $20 for Wi-Fi. It's not free. Now we're taking up. Nothing's for free, my guy. You gotta pay for everything in this oh, world. Which is pretty crazy That's because I is. can literally watch it on my TV. And because it's a 16-hour flight, I get to take a sh Look at how nice this bathroom is. You have a sink, a toilet, and then a shower. That is crazy. Look at that. We wow. are 30 What? You got a shower in a plane. Here, and I can take a shower. On top of that, me and the boys can order as much gourmet food as we want. And that's wow. not all. We saved the best for last. Hey, how's it going? There's a private so lounge fun. in the back of the plane. Hey, Jimmy. Yeah. Ow. You're not dreaming. That was the $10,000. Lounge in the plane. Let's go, man. I'll be nice. Plane ticket. Point the camera up and down. And now we're at the $25,000 plane ticket that is up these stairs. That's right. There're floors. This is insane. This is crazy. We're gonna be sitting grand. above other people. Oh my god. Bro, that's like a whole that's someone's whole life savings, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is your room. For $25,000, you get two massive rooms. Oh, this is crazy. I've never seen anything like this. Holy cow. Our space on this plane is literally four times bigger than the last one. I've never seen a plane where I can comfortably do jumping jacks. Look at this. We also get two chairs, a ton of TVs. There are more TVs in this one room than all of the other planes we've been on. Food served by a wow. personal flight attendant. Why is it that after a certain price point, they always give you caviar and a bathroom. Can we talk about something? <laughs> this bathroom is like a disappointment. 
apartment. No shower, no heated floors, half the size. I think the $10,000 flight was a better price point. Would you pay this kind of money for a single flight? I wouldn't recommend this. I would recommend a car. Buy a car instead. And now the best part. Yeah, I can buy like 10 cars with that much money. A queen size bed. Wow. Ooh. Why don't they just make every seat a bed? Bro, instead of three seats side by side, just put a bunk bed with three beds. Well, I know. Well, maybe not everyone wants to sleep. They want to sit up. But still, they can still make the bunk Yeah, that's actually a good idea, man. Make it a bunk bed. Good morning. That was really good sleep. Carl, wake up. We're going to land. I slept like a rock. That was the world's most like expensive commercial star. flight. Time for private flights. One hundred thousand dollars, man. Not two lifetimes to save up for that money. Rising niggas getting up. This is the hundred thousand dollar plane. This thing is huge. Just blowing that in the video, man. This guy. This crazy. price point, you get the entire plane. <laughs> of course, you would get the entire plane. Private, private, private. Oh, it's like a yacht. This is wild. This is yeah, unbelievable. That's why, like, that's how Floyd Money Mayweather flies in. You know. What you want to know the craziest part? This is just one of four rooms. There's more to the plane. I thought this was it. Guys, come over here. What room is this? This is literally another lounge area with a bunch of snacks and a huge TV. And if you're feeling tired, you get your own private bed. Wow, man, that's amazing, bro. Look at that. That's like that's like almost like a. It looks better than someone's bedroom, almost. Wow, Ever. that's incredible, dude! What? This is like a hotel. And last, yeah, but not hotel least, the bath. Tariq, shut your mouth right now. Yeah. Shut it. This is from why Andrew Tate fights him, bro. You know what I'm saying? Andrew Tate and Tristan Tate. Have you ever even seen a chance? Boy, subscribe no. if you haven't yeah, already. What do we talk about while on our private jet? Well, home. I'll tell you. Last year, I sold the uh, the Smitherman's oh, account. Geez. Oh wait, I just realized I'm oh, taking off backwards. Oh, I'm taking off backwards. Oh, oh shit! I didn't realize you were taking off. Not the camera! Oh, this is crazy. Oh, oh. <laughs> Boy, you might be sitting down, bro. Why the fuck is taking off? You come to jump in like that? But I'm fasting the sit down. This might be the best bathroom yet. This is the toilet. On the toilet, you no can way. watch TV. Hey, Nolan, I hope you feel comfortable in the bathroom. What's going on? I'm so confused. That looks like it. No. That toilet looks like so <laughs> no. He's never getting out. Oh, wow. Boy, I had steak, mashed potatoes, oh, and veggies. And you guys inspired me a little bit, so I brought some pizza. Yay! Wow. This is my favorite plane because it has YouTube. But we didn't pop up first, so now awesome. it's not. You can tell this is a rich person big because there's like 500 pillows. This one out of here, that one out of here. Bro, this guy's like, oh no, man, I'm saying. Yeah, I'm saying. Wait, even the flight attendants is twerking for them. I'm gonna fly this thing. And that's the beauty of flying private. You can do whatever you want, whenever. Carl's flying the plane, Chandler's jamming out the pizza, Chris is taking a nap, and I don't even know where Nolan went. There's no layovers when you fly private, and there's no TSA, so you save tons of time. Hence why basically every rich person you know owns a private jet. Hey guys. Yeah? We're gonna land soon. Carl, let me out! We're about ready to land, you gotta let me out, bro. Oh, oh, oh my god. That was the opposite of smooth. <laughs> wait, wait, is Nolan still in the bathroom? Yeah, that guy's sitting on the toilet. I don't know. <laughs> low and order. How was your flight? <laughs> Still better than $1,000. Wait, that was a low and order theme, wasn't it? It was the opposite of smooth. <laughs> wait, wait, is Nolan still in the bathroom? I don't know. Yeah, it is, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so better than one thousand. Let's go. <laughs> and now the three hundred thousand dollar blip. I'll unblur it in a second. Why are you blurring? Before I remove your blindfolds, what do you think is on the side of the blimp? Is it Nolan's phone number? Did you do Nolan's phone number? That would be funny. Next time. Take off your blindfolds. I love Turn some around. peace. <laughs> oh no. I heard Carl's mom. <laughs> oh, Why? He really loves my mom. No, Carl, he hearts your mom. He He's a motherfucker. That. No, I love her. That's what oh. he is. Dude, He's right a now? mother lover. Oh. You mother lover. It's like moving. This giant aircraft can literally just be pulled by a rope. And you might be wondering, how did I afford this giant blimp and pay six figures to wrap it? Wait, how that been a grand bro for the whole Parker, I'm recruiting that I use to hire people like editors, cameramen, and accountants. Let's see if it stops floating when I get on it. 
That's gains, dude. Does that mean I'm fat? It means you work out a lot. Or I'm fat. Zip Recruiter is where people go to discover their next great job. If this blimp crashes and I die, uh -huh. you guys can just use Zip Recruiter to find a new job. That'll make it hey. so much easier. Thanks, Thanks, man. Like this you want to leave All right, let's do this. Goodbye, Chandler. Goodbye, forever. I think I heard forever. He could have promoted anything, and he chose Carl's mom. I'm terrified. <laughs> <I'm laughs> well, we'll see you at the race. Oh, and I forgot to mention, we're flying this blimp over 150,000 people at the world's largest race car event, and wow. Carl has no idea. Before I die in this blimp, I want to tell you guys about ZipRecruiter. We recently made a job posting on ZipRecruiter, and I'm going to call one of the candidates and interview them. I saw your application on ZipRecruiter. Can you hear me? Uh, yes, I can. Is that Mr. Beast? Yeah, I'm Mr. Beast. It doesn't matter. Sorry, uh, I can barely hear you right now. Yeah, because... <laughs> no, we're is that Mr. Beast? Yeah, it is. But don't worry. What have you been an editor for? <laughs> Dude, I've been going, no, man. Yeah, so, I would just be like, uh, I've been going crazy, man. Hey, guys. And a little creative innovation. I can definitely make your videos better. Okay, not bad. Send me some examples of your work. If, like Thomas, you want a shot to come work for us, click the link in the description or go to supercooter.com slash Mr. Beast. We're going to look at every single person that applies. Oh. And that the Daytona 500, which is one of the busiest events ever. You couldn't have put something better on the blimp? No, this is perfect. This is wrong. <laughs> it is see wrong. Us? You can see it. Carl, I can confirm everyone loves your mom down here. Good, man. You're a psycho for your mom. He is, bro. He's a psychopath, bro. There's no way this guy's a normal dude. And now, the most dude. expensive private <laughs> plane ticket on the planet. Half a million dollars. What? Get oh, out. welcome aboard. I suggest you take your shoes off. The carpet's actually two million dollars. She's like, I suggest... Two million dollars. What? God damn. Oh my God. You know what I'm saying? I have a plane ticket on the plane. Gee, that Hi, welcome aboard. I suggest you take your shoes off. The carpet's actually two million dollars. Hey, Bitch, I don't need to know how much it costs, man. You need to go dig us out. It's like I suggested. Really hard. And by square feet, this is bigger than our houses. It's almost impossible to imagine. Wow, that's actually really nice. Look at look at the color, man. It's like gray, white floors and the wood. How big this jet actually is, right? Two million dollar car. Here is a bedroom. Wow, a bedroom. Another bedroom. That actually looks like a house. I'm not gonna lie. An apartment. Another bedroom. Keep going. This is for the crew. Another bedroom. <laughs> What'd you find? My dim. The bedrooms on this plane are way more extravagant. Gold plated sinks, multiple showers. Gold Wait, what's plated? there? That's the toilet. Wow. This plane comes with its own theater, a lounge that can seat up to 12 people, wow. and then over here is the living room. This is like a bigger couch than what I have in my house. I just <laughs> want you to know, you've only seen a third of the plane so far. There's more? What? Oh, we got some good Xbox. stuff. You nah, call a flight attendant to your bedroom. If we could do this every time we fly, I'd live in the air. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> now I'd live in the oh, air. <laughs> Sorry, I'm turning the lights on and off. How did I miss this room? Like, we walked around the whole plane. And in case you thought you saw everything, there's also massages on this plane. How is it, Carl? It's amazing. It's so really amazing. <laughs> the guys go, what? That's the luxury, bro. Gentlemen, how were we able it's to amazing this plane? I would say only our fans. And because of that, we invited a bunch of random subscribers on this half a million dollar plane ride. Have you ever flown on a private jet before? No, this is my first time. And it's the most expensive one on the planet. I've never seen anything like this on a plane. Like, this is crazy. Ma'am? Well, that nigga's wearing his shoes in a $2 million dollar car. What is this right here? You know what I'm saying? Didn't you just throw it? I didn't think she'd literally throw it. This is the chocolate you need to serve from now on, okay? Got it. It's called Feast Bulls. It's the highest rated chocolate on the planet. What the heck is over this way? Yeah, this has got to be a piece. secret room. That's where the crew is. We just got a bunch of funny looks. The problem is. Attention, child. boys. We're about to take off. <laughs> Pass your seatbelt and stop being hooligan. Thank you. <laughs> Ouch. Typically, the what kind of people check. fly on a plane like this? Business people? How do my dumb friends compare? <laughs> so pretty dumb, I guess it's it. <laughs> At this price point, they serve the highest quality food anytime you want it and wherever on the plane you want it. Even in your own private master suite. You want some? 
<laughs> Do you guys even know where we're going? No. God we're damn. taking you all to Disney World and we're gonna give you. This guy's are living in a dream. Are we living in a dream? Days of old expense pay trips to do whatever you want. No way. So if you want to fly on the most expensive jet in the world and then spend two days all paid for in Disney World, subscribe. Yeah. In this video, I flew around the lot of big planes. I wanted to do my part to protect the environment, so. I plan to 100k cheese as well as protect over 100 acres of rain. Wow! This guy's amazing, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's all I have for today, boys. I really hope you did enjoy. If you're still watching, I love you. Please, please subscribe to the channel. Drop a like. I'll catch you on the next video, baby. And I'm out. Peace.